Yes, we can keep it for everyone. And we'll put it for everyone, but you know, if you're not, if you want to do like some more stability work on the ground and maybe even glove up, little big gloves don't matter. We'll talk about that. If you don't have a partner, um, you can have some fun. But off the bat, this could just be a reference point too. Even if you're just like um, shadowing, you can imagine like where is he? Is he in a way? Am I really close? Mm -hmm. Alright, we just kind of just slowly, but then we kind of just like getting the shoulder pressure, moving around, right? Switching moving around. Balancing in different points is gonna be helpful. We're gonna do that different stuff. You can just literally pass some fun, shh, 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 small, try to work, right? And then work that pressing up too. All of this is not casual. It's not like the rep ends here, and then we Casually get up. We get up, place pressure on them, our legs are away, press up, and get away. All right, so we can have some fun with that. And if you want to practice a couple other things, um, just for stability, work around the clock, we'll talk about that. So let's say we're down, we sprawl, practice bouncing here. I'm going to come to the side, and imaginary head. I can get up for sure. I can. Get up partially, I can start working some knees. I can balance, this is knee on belly. Shin here, we wanna make sure our butt is nice and low. If I get a little too high, not balance. So we can start just with this joint. Like from here, switch side to side. This leg is far away. Can you do that switch again? Yeah. This leg is close, so imagine your head, they can start grabbing your leg. This is a good position if we have a lot of stability. From here, we have a lot of strikes. We start mixing in strikes. Either the power or just working. So, let's talk a little bit about the strikes. I'm not on my feet, I can't pivot in the same way. Let's say I'm just straight up throwing the equivalent of like a, a rear cross. A lot of people are like just arm punches. Because we can't do it in the same way. We still want to activate. Now, I can't do everything, but I can still turn a little bit in. This is another level. If we're going top down, we can frame short elbow. Analogous to what we might do in a different position. And the feet, like if, can I use real quick? So, let's say for whatever reason, we were here, right? We can work here, but you can also. Come in here. Same idea. Thank you. Frame. Pressing down, pressing down the way. Frame. See where you are. Are we hovering? Good. We're up here. What have you brought? So play right here. Here. Drill. Fun stuff off of that. Switch our knees, start working around. We'll get there eventually. But for now, even if no one's around, you can play around with this sucker. Imagine this someone shooting on you, okay. straw, and then practice digging in that shoulder and see if you can balance. Move around mm -hmm. and stand up. Because the standing is, is tough because it's all unstable. But being mean is really much like required for pressing. Yeah. Turning all our weight is on them, you know. Um, when we're doing it nicely with each other, like we're both kind of light, you'll see, like, if you were, this, is, this doesn't even exist in this gym for you, so you can pretty much go hard, but if you were heavier, a lot heavier than someone, you can, like, be nice to them if you're going slow, put some of your weight on the mat, right, and go. But you should be able to still, you should do a hip style hard on. Almost all of us, because you're very light. You're not gonna like be rude or anything like that, anyone. So uh, that's good. Thanks, sir.